we are back. You glad to be back? And we got a new camera too. What's up guys? It's been a while, but I'm glad to be back. And today, we're going with the fam to the museum. That kind of rhymed, unintentional. We're gonna see an iconic costume. I'll give you a hint. That's right, the original Superman costume from the 1950s television show. You guys excited? Woohoo! You getting ready with your Superman bib? <laughs> yeah? And to celebrate, Christopher got a Superman chair. I don't know why Superman would ever need a chair because he flies, but we have a lion guarding it. My dad is coming with us, so it should be a great day, great family fun day. And I know it was gone for a long time, but I'm glad to be back. Sometimes you have to put your passions on hold to help out other people. But that doesn't mean you give them up. Are we seeing Superman today? Eat your grapes. They look like kryptonite. You look like Lex Luthor still. It's great that my son can feed himself. It'll be even better when he can just feed me and I won't have to exert any energy. Yep. You gonna feed daddy? Yeah. All right, so we are headed to the Historical Society in Columbus, Ohio, one of my favorite places. And uh, we got my dad in the back. Go ahead and show him. <laughs> Lauren's still learning how to hold the camera. Whenever I say, there's this person here, you always show him. Christopher was named after Christopher Reeve, who was once Superman. Oh, that's the connection. Well, Lauren doesn't know that. That was what it was in my heart. But I like alliteration, and comic book characters always have alliteration in their name, too. Passing the first ever soccer stadium in the United States. I know it's not that big. Really? Yeah, it is the first one. It's the first one in the United States. I know it's called football everywhere else, but it's soccer here. That's the Ohio Historical Society. It's, uh, it does look like a big sandwich. Everything relates back to food. I used to think history was pretty boring when I was a kid, but not when it's Superman. Look at this. Different Howard time. Johnson. Oh Howard Johnson? That's still a hotel chain. No, there's one, I think it was the last one closed. That's not true. Lauren and I went to the one in Chicago. Howard Johnson? Howard Johnson, yeah. There's a lot of them. Yeah, McDonald's maybe, maybe it's the, was it a hotel or a restaurant? It was a hotel. Are you learning so much about history? <laughs> yeah? <laughs> you gonna be like your granddad? <laughs> Love history? There's the big mastodon. It's not dinosaur. Think of all the meat you could kebab on those tusks. He likes it. Do you like it? Mastodon was one of the Power Rangers. Yeah. Mastodon! Look, Lauren. I'm not a dinosaur. No dinosaurs in Ohio. No fossils. We lose that battle. No dinosaurs in Ohio. But I will say my wife is dino might. Right? Right? Look at that. The Walking Dead was on the radio show back then. That's incredible. Superman really was ahead of his time. Why don't you go out for a walk? Huh? The air will do you good. I don't think it will be advisable after what happened this afternoon. Perhaps you'd better stay in, Jim. I'm sorry, Mom. I gotta go. I'll see you later. Right, Jim. Riveting stuff. Can I? Just riveting. So that was the Superman radio show. Pretty riveting. If you can imagine, before television, that was what everyone did. Yeah. We just sat around, listened to the radio, and that was the drama for the day. Did you do your chores? Shut up, Mom. I'm my own person. Those otters are huge. Yeah, they are big otters. Well, they just can't turn you hot. You like the otter? Is it doing what an otter do? <laughs> then the cougar. What is on that guy? You know? Cougars now are much more dangerous. Those older women. Honey badger doesn't care. He got stung like a thousand times. Stealing jokes from other viral videos. Other, like mine's gonna go viral. Possums are just giant rats. They are gross. The infamous two-headed calf. Nah, did not live very long. 
When they say two heads are better than one, they didn't know about this thing. Loaf of bread was less, but it was much smaller too. So there's some progress there, huh? No, wait, that just shows you the relative size. No. Average, come on, those are pictures. Those are, but there's like a line graph. Did you make the graph? No. You don't know what you're talking there's no, about. There's no piece of loaf of bread that looks like that. Sure there is. It was a, it was a different time, Dad. Were you there? Yes. You were. Was it black and white? Game, set, match. Game, set, match. He has a memory problem. You having fun? <laughs> Learning can be fun when you tear paper and rage. Oh yeah. Oh my god. We should move in here. We should move in here. I always wanted to live in the 1950s. Why? There's no internet. It just looks so fun. But the internet. Welcome! Make yourself at home in our modern house. I am a massive tool. I want a picture of him in the 1950s high chair. Alright, relax. You know, I have to say, for the 50s, that's not a really small TV. That's pretty cool. I mean, it's black and white, but whatever, dude. Look at that. There he is. That would have worked. He would have well, but he's gonna eat that, even though it's fake. He knows what he's supposed to do in there. It's pretty cool. Is this what your house looked like, Dad, when you were a kid? No, we had a, a bigger house than that. Ah, Mr. Like Moneybags over there. We had plates like this. Oh, yeah, plates have really changed. <laughs> Still a, a little video. saucer. Take I remember, a video for I remember grandma? Kid, I remember kid, kid plates like that. Are you having fun? <laughs> little kitchen oh, here. Ooh, peanuts. French's mustard made lemon pie flavor. I think I'll pass. That's what I drink now. I wish it came in that much. Ah, oh, that's a lot of coffee. Let's go washing machine here. This is, no, this is the iron. Oh, this is the how is this an iron? Iron, right? This is the here's your ironing board. What? This is a washing machine, guys. Look at the look at the writing on the wall. I don't remember anything like that. Apparently, there's a dog leash. I don't know, man. I'm not buying it. It's definitely really cool. Who needs a clock in the bathroom? Are you timing your bowel movements? Definitely a little racially insensitive back then. Sorry. Kids hung up maps. No sports stars, maps, even a weird hat like a fedora. Milady. Aw, Johnny's so cute. Don't wear fedoras when you're older, kid. Ew. It's not real. David Crockett, king of the wild frontier. And then this is where the magic happens, next to a baby's crib. That's kind of weird, but, you know, if you only have a two-bedroom house. That's quite a vanity. Well, here we are, the crown jewel. It's getting lit pretty well. Goodness, I never would have. I don't know, Lauren. You said you saw that. It's on the thing. I'm sure it's around here. George Reeve wasn't, or George Reeves. He wasn't the first Superman, but he was probably the most prolific yeah. back then, at least. Man, he must have been small. That looks like a scarf for me. I guess they have to they have to keep it kind of dark because the lights hurt it. Now, a lot of people might not know this, but the creators of Superman were from Ohio. They're from Cleveland, actually. It's pretty cool to be standing next to such an iconic costume. I think we're very lucky to have the creators of Superman be from Ohio, and he's such a an American icon, and uh, it's really cool to be here, to, to just be right next to. Even back then, cheap knockoff costumes for kids were existed, and they probably wore them with fun. <laughs> Superman horseshoes. What game would Superman play? Of course, horseshoes. Ohio Roots. Woo! Flying. I can't believe they froze this horse in stone. What's that song, Dad? Battle Hymn of the Republic. Battle Hymn of the Republic, duh. I should have shazammed it. Here we go, we're 
it's dangerous. See, construction zones have been a big part of American history. Every time you want to go somewhere, construction is blocking your way. Horseshoeing and repairing. Also, drink a beer. What is in his hand, Dad? Uh, um, oh. <laughs> That's gonna make the video. Uh, is that a piece of cheese? I don't know. Wooden cheese. I wouldn't cheese, right? Am I right? Yes. Yeah, I'm so funny. Oh, wow. A Wonder Woman comic. That's gotta be worth some cash. Batman. That's worth some cheddar. <laughs> they have a White Castle exhibit over there. White Castle is really big in Ohio too. And they have a whole exhibit here. And uh, when my wife and I met, we actually bonded over White Castle, is that correct? I don't remember that. <sighs> She won free White Castle for a uh, year. Yeah. See, you won free White Castle for a year. And I was like, I better date her for at least a year. Menu. Eight cents for a donut. Seven cents for a small coffee. 14, 14 cents for a large coffee. Harold and Kumar would have loved those prices. Did Granddad get you a Superman? <laughs> Did you get a Superman? You eating Superman's cape? Well, it was fun going to the museum, and uh, now just a standard rest of the day. <laughs> Dishes. <laughs> so I don't know if this is safe. I've done it before in vlogs, but I'm spinning, and he likes it. But I just don't know if it's the right thing to do, but he was crying, and I ran out of ideas. I'm not a very resourceful father. Well, maybe I am. Maybe this is a sign that I am. What do you think? Yeah? <laughs> you look a little drunk. Maybe I'm going too fast. Get my son spin toxicated. I'm glad I could take you guys along on a day that was really special to me. You know, Superman is more than just a really cool superhero. Superman was created by two guys from Cleveland who were in high school. If that's not an inspiration to do what you're passionate about now, then I don't know what is. I took a break from these vlogs and it was a real bummer, but I didn't give up and you guys shouldn't give up either. You're gonna come into obstacles, take care of what you need to, and then get back to what you love. Thanks so much for watching and your support, and remember, whatever dude.